here we are, changing of the guard. Fancy people on horses. What a beautiful park right next to Buckingham Palace. This is tall trees, nice canopy, hiding the sun in a nice shade. That's the Buckingham Palace in the distance. And here are my three daughters. I caught them on camera. <laughs> and here's the other two girls, my wife and Daenerys. Big happy family. Yes? Family? This looks like hyssop, H-Y-S-S-O-P, which is the same you can get in New World when you are harvesting for your food and cooking. This is exactly what you harvest in that game. Pretty cool. George with hyssop. There are many, many geese all around here. Oh, swans. Many, many swans all around. And they're lounging on the grass as well over there. I actually didn't expect to see so many birds. Hi, Goose. I like your beak. Was oh, that a swan? No, 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 no. You are right. It might be a swan. Welcome to the Diana, which is the Princess of Wales Memorial Fountain. Right here. It's a big circle that represents the openness of the princess, where you can go to the center of the fountain one of any one of three ways that is kensington palace next to a memorial with a guy on a horse in the kensington gardens these are the gardens these are the kensington gardens all around us this is quite a backyard can you imagine living in a palace with this as your backyard that's only further rich or the royalty as they call it here in Britain. And here is Big Ben. I'm told this is not Big Ben, but it looks like Big Ben to me. Lots of people around here. Let's grab my bag. Uh, I'm carrying this around. So this is a stadium. We're at Camden Town, but this is a little ways away from Camden. Very modern construction, which is nice. Next to the old brick everywhere, brick construction. This is new. Much more modern. And there's a big hotel there. And that apparently is not Big Ben. All right, I stand corrected. No, that's such a sad Big Ben. <laughs> that's a sad Big Ben? This is me with my daughter. Hello. All right. Let's keep going. Where are we? I'll give you a hint. Do you recognize this palace? It is the Buckingham Palace in London. And this is George in London. We are traveling, visiting London as part of our family trip, which my wife organized. And I'm going to see a place I've never been, which is London, and then Belgium, and then a few other places in Europe. Lots of people this morning, and there's this gold statue right behind me. And I'm not sure what it represents, but it's pretty colorful. There, let me zoom in. Yeah, it's pretty golden. And we're gonna go see a lot of places, so let's continue the journey. Life is a journey, right guys? So you need to explore everywhere. All right, and get inspired and get to Try new things to help you improve and do more. Get more out of life before, you know, life ends. Life does end. My dad recently passed away, so it's a clear reminder of how special every day is. So yeah, let's make the most of it and check out a bit of London. So here we are, changing of the guard. see people on horses. And I am here, a horse myself. This is my rider. I'm the horse. <laughs> Hi Daenerys. All right, I think that was it. So here we are. Make sure you've got water. 
make sure your bags are on your front to stop people stealing. That's the pickpocket warning. What a beautiful park right next to Buckingham Palace. This is tall trees, nice canopy, hiding the sun in a nice shade. That's the Buckingham Palace in the distance. And we are just getting ready for the changing of the guard. And while we're waiting, we thought let's go to the nice park. So yeah, this is a very pleasant area. It's very shaded and I'm here with my family. We have our daughter, Daenerys. Say hi, Daenerys. Then we have my beautiful wife and my three kids who don't like being on camera. So they're quickly running away. Right, let's go back and see the changing of the guard. Here we are at another memorial, a pretty impressive statue of wings on a gun or a cannon. I think so. Let's zoom this in, is have a look. Looks like a cannon with an angel. So yeah, it's a big arch and it's in the middle of the city. We're at the edge of the park, lots of cars. And the Royal Park where we were just at over there is the smallest of eight Royal Parks at 40 acres. It's pretty big actually, in my opinion. But it's a beautiful area, well maintained. Quite an impressive site in the center of London. And we're gonna keep walking. And we'll see what other sites we can find. And there's my family right in front of me. And we're gonna keep exploring London today. Onwards and upwards <laughs> with this bag. And here are my three daughters. I caught them on camera. <laughs> and this is a little section of that fountain, just a nice walkway fountain is right there and here's the other two girls my wife and Daenerys big happy family yes yeah. family yeah. all right you came across this fountain of a fish a fisherman that's a little fountain but it's not running among the park we're in Kensington Park now and you can see it's Again, a beautiful park in the middle of the city. Very well kept. And we're going to keep walking. We're now going to get to the Kensington Palace. It's about a 10 minute walk through these trees. All right, let's go, fishermen. This looks like Hyssop, H-Y-S-S-O-P, which is the same you can get in New World when you are harvesting for your food and cooking. This is exactly what you harvest in that game. Pretty cool. George with hyssop. Hyssop? Hyssop. Continuing our walk through the garden. It's beautiful. Lots of flowers, people. Very nice design. Some birds lounging there on the grass. Yeah, this is London. I had no idea. It was such a nice place, in the middle of the city even. Not have such large parks in Dubai in the middle of the city. <laughs> Alright, continue. There are many, many geese all around here. Oh, swans. Many, many swans all around. And they're lounging on the grass as well over there. I actually didn't expect to see so many birds because, like, truly, they're everywhere. Not just on the water. They even get in the way, apparently, when you're jogging. They just kind of jump in front of you. Look out for the birds! We found a lake. This is the Serpentine in the park, the Royal Park. It's quite a large lake, and we're gonna walk along it in that direction to get to the Kensington Gardens. Pretty cool. Lots of geese. You can hear them in the distance. And yeah, I'm here with my beautiful wife and our kids who are becoming more and more complaining about walking too much and it's too hot. There they are. <laughs> but that's okay. No pain, no gain. Let's continue on. 
to Kensington Garden. And we're not oh, supposed to feed the birds here. Don't feed the birds. It's a panoramic view of the park where we currently are. And let's continue. Oh, there's a big geese, goose here. Hi, goose. I like your beak. Oh, is that a swan? No, 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 you are right. It might be a swan. Yeah, I think it's a pretty big swan, I must say. Comfortably swimming in the lake. I don't know. Yeah, goose are there, right? Hey, you're blocking the goose. Welcome to the Diana, which is the Princess of Wales Memorial Fountain. Right here. It's a big circle that represents the openness of the princess, where you can go to the center of the fountain, one of any one of three ways, three entrances. And there's obviously lots of kids, people cooling off in the water. And this is all part of the Kensington Royal Park here in the heart of London. Didn't expect to be, see so many people, to be honest. It is a Friday, so I guess school is out, but doesn't everyone need to work? It's not a Saturday. All right, so yeah, let's continue on. That is Kensington Palace, next to a memorial with a guy on a horse in the Kensington Gardens. These are the gardens. These are the Kensington Gardens all around us. You notice the trees. Some of them are quite tall, but many are like big bushes. They are just on the ground, basically. It's a nice contrast like that one over there. See, these are taller, and there's a bunch that just kind of grow right from the ground. The leaves are touching the grass. They did a good job picking everything to make it look very beautiful here in the Kensington Gardens. And we're gonna go see the palace over there next, as soon as my troop take a break. Here they are, sitting under the tree in the shade. I don't know why they're so wimpy. It's not that hot and it's a beautiful day. I like to walk. It's uh, very relaxing. Nice break from the computer and the work, the hustle bustle of business. Forties for freedom family, heartbeat. Yeah, we're taking a break from all that to enjoy nature here in London. And let's continue. Here we are at the Round Pond, just outside the Kensington Palace. We walked right through the trees along that path to get here. This is quite a backyard. Can you imagine living in a palace with this as your backyard? That's only for the rich, or the royalty as they call it here in Britain. 